and welcome everyone this is Mohammad Arslan and you're watching my channel Mark Siddiqui in the previous lecture we have studied that how to do operations how to do arithmetic operation using the inner HTML and now today we are going to continue the same lecture with the logic that how we are going to write in the browser and what type of technology or what type of tricks or methods we are going to use to write in the browser so let's see what we have to learn today we have to learn today document.write and it's lecture number nine in the last lectures we were working with the inner html it was dot inner html when we were writing and tags between the html element and we were sometime writing the h1 tag or we sometime we were writing some different tags but now we are going to completely write a document so we are going to create a complete document with the this line document dot write so there are so many ways to write into browser as we have discussed that uh, we can use the inner html we can use document dot write we can use uh, console dot log for checking some errors and we can use the alert as well but uh, for this scenario we are going to use document dot write after an html document is loaded will delete all existing html the, this thing the main thing is that as we have loaded the document and there are some tags some elements but as we run the script which contain the line document dot write it means it is going to refresh the whole document it is going to delete all the existing elements of the html and it is going to replace with that one what we are going to use between the right braces so let's have a demo of it on the visuals to visual code and have a result on the browser as well together okay guys so here we are i have already written some basic code basic tags because i don't want to write the tags again and again and this is going to be very basic basic for you if you have watched my previous lectures and if you have missed them so i recommend you to go back again and start the series again start the series from the very beginning so you can understand each and everything that how we are going to maintain this flow to learn javascript so i need to come to the come between the body element and uh, i am going to write some basic tags like i am writing h1 and here i am going to use my name after this i am going to write a paragraph okay after this I'm going to write another paragraph basically I'm giving you some a bit of my introduction as well in this line that what I am basically I am a full stack software developer as well so just refresh the page and you can see that few of the elements few of the tags which I have written there are appearing in the same manner is as on the browser but uh, what i am going to tell you is that as i write the script of as i write the script of document.write what it is going to do it is going to delete all my previous tags so let's see how to do this uh, before after the body i'm going to create a tag a script and in the script tag i want to write document.write and uh, in this braces I want to say 5 plus 7 means 12 and just save it and refresh it so as I refresh it what happens document dot write only write 12 but in the beginning of this lecture I was telling that as this line executes as this line comes to be run what happens all the previous tags are deleted but remember what I said I said once the document is loaded now the document is loaded and this line is loaded with the previous tags it means that's why it is not disappearing it but if I run if I load only this line after loading all these tags what is going to happen 
this line it is going to is going to delete all the previous elements so i'm going to give you a simple example i know it is going to be some of bit tricky so let's create a simple example i want to create a button and uh, in button i would write change everything save it and refresh it so you can see it's appearing here change everything but nothing is happening with this button because uh, we don't have any event listener on it so here in the attribute in the attribute place i want to write on click whenever we click on this button what we are going to do we are going to do document dot write five plus seven that's it as i click as i click on this button this line will execute and as this line executes it will delete all the previous loaded elements of the browser so let's have a demo of it refresh the page just click on this button and you can see only 12 is remaining except these all so you may get confused that it may be this 12 as well so i am just going to remove this script remove that script save the page refresh again you can see all the previous elements they are appearing because the document is loaded and this is not loaded because it has not caught this listener event and its listener event is that whenever we click on this button so as i click on this button it is going to execute and it is going to remove all the previous elements even though it is going to remove all the previous scripts as well so the script which was dry which was written here it was also deleted at the time but not to get confused that's why i deleted that script and it has nothing to do with that recent document because this line has completely refreshed the document okay so that's enough for today if you have any query you can talk to me you can contact me you can send me an email or you can write a comment below so do subscribe the channel have a good day thank you